Well, Albians, it's been a fun campaign with you, Albians, but it's about to end in a very spectacular way here. Uh, oh. Alright, neighbor, that. you're Bohemia. Looks like neighbor is my new neighbor. Hello, Spud guy. I'm, uh, I'm with Bohemia here. If we win this, I'm taking both the things okay. for Elvian, by the way, okay? How? But, and after... Does it look like we're winning this battle? He's attacking me. Bohemia, get in here now. Bohemia, help, help, help. I'm sending everything right now. I'm sending everything. Right, my whole army is wiped. You got wiped. Bohemia and Bavaria, you can wipe peace now. Okay. There has been a slight modification in what we think that the peace deal should look like, okay? When you say we, mm -hmm. you get the Albians, I get the Nubians. How about the Rhinish? We can split them in half or something. Okay. Split all the Rhinish in half. We won this war without the Albion support at all. He didn't send a single brigade to contribute. It was Bavaria. Just remember that. This is just a wild guess, but I'm imagining you might eventually backstab Albions, right? I can't say. They sold the Rhineland to Albion, but he's not going to join their side. Ideally, he would join their side so I can end up against the Albions without feeling bad about betraying him. Yeah, we should kill him and you can form Germany. Wow. Formed. Beautiful. Ah. Oh. Nice. This is misery. I'm being backstabbed. I mean, it was kind of expected. First time? Nah, this is exactly what I wanted, because I didn't have the heart to backstab him. But since he's backstabbing me, that takes the work. Welcome back to the Bavaria series. Could this finally be the episode where I form Germany? It's been a gradual process, one or two regions at a time, but after 21 episodes and numerous wars, it seems like we're finally on the brink. What do I need to form it now? I need to either own or have in my sphere of influence the remaining cores of the German Empire. Pomerania and Holstein, owned by Scandinavia, are already in the bag. They'll be handed over to me in a temporary transfer whenever I have everything else ready. My troops are lined up on the Elbian border, my long-term rival. I've researched military directionism and we're about to find out if the Elbian Confederation has as well. That's the technology which contains the inventions gas attack and gas defence. Those inventions are set to a 100% chance in this mod to remove that RNG element. It's all down to when you can research the tech. Otherwise, I have a comfortably larger brigade count than him although he still boasts a respectable amount of troops, considering he's lost a lot of wars now. No one else is intervening, this is finally a 1v1 to decide the fate of Germany. It was the fate of Burgundy that was decided in the last episode. He was hit hard by the combined dual monarchy, Spanish and Italian alliance, which is building up as a bloc to rival the world's dominant naval power, Scandinavia. In exchange for staying out of that war because I've been a historic ally of the dual monarchy, I received the Rhineland in a transfer, one of the key regions of Germany and one of the things I needed. This also means that Burgundy and I no longer need to be enemies. But then the Joker nation fought off a Batavian and Scandinavian invasion. 
They were seeking to form the Netherlands, another funny exiled country, but there's no room for them, we've already got England. Other things that are building up to happen in this episode. Russia and the PLC are going to fight a 1v1. Virtual Rock has guided Russia through a very nice comeback, and the PLC is being substituted by Zombie, who's also substituting India at the same time after that player just quit the game. The chances of Poland winning at this point are almost zero. Russia has gained significant land off them in the past couple of major wars, where Poland has decided to split his attention between me and Russia. And by the way, Russia managed to secure Terrania as an ally and a buffer against the Asian hog box. And they did a bit of transferring in the previous episode, so that Terrania gets some land that's mostly his accepted pops. The ADF, Asian Defeat Force, is going to launch its next attack on Japan, the outlying member of the Asian hog box, who the mainlanders haven't raised a finger to aid at all. Nusantara tried helping Japan in the last war, but he ended up just getting blockaded. Arcadia, Gran Colombia, England and Scandinavia are going for an all-out partition of Japan. And this time they already have a foothold on the mainland, so they don't need to do naval invasions. Now before we get into the action, please consider joining the channel membership. A great way to support the channel that gives you some perks. The more channel members we have, the more emotes I can give you. I recently was able to unlock another one after getting 100, so you can now enjoy posting North FC. Remember you can tune into some great streams right here, live on the main channel on YouTube, and then after they're done they'll be transferred over to the Spudgun Archives VOD channel. And of course there's my Patreon where you can support the channel and get bonus clips, my Discord and my Twitter. Now without further ado, enjoy the video! It's happening. War of Unification, Northern Deck. Uh, hold on a sec. Right, let's let's organize this properly. Uh... Michael, pause. <laughs> Michael, pause. Now I'm giving everyone time. I'm giving everyone time, including my enemy. So Why is Spud Michael pausing? All right, so I I advise everyone to watch this. I'm watching it. I'm watching it. Oh yeah, I need to send visions. Yeah, no, I need visions. Oh, it's going to be. Can I, Spud? Can I join that to abuse my own rules? Oh my God! Oh, he didn't get gas in time. He didn't get gas. I forgot. I forgot. He forgot. He forgot. It's over. It's unequivocally over. If I didn't have gas, I could still do this. It's renal mode. Oh, well, the Ottomans are all Oh, I'm not joining. Just do your own wars. Well, then why are you moving? I'm not joining. Well, then why would you? Well, why? Why are the Ottomans? Moving? Oh, you surrendered. Multi-province. Your army is away. He's unequivocally oh, okay. German. Hundreds and thousands of Albion people. Albion soldiers people? have been saved. People? People? Um, <laughs> I can't use Add to Sphere on him. Because China speared him. Oh, uh, Ottoman is uh, kind of dead on me. You could ask him very nicely. Don't unspear me, China, I swear to God. <laughs> nice. uh, I mean, Isn't what's in it for me? It takes I'll give you one million dollars. I have to deck on China, which I will. that prick's face when he saw the gas. (laughs) (laughs) 
We should we should do the second war on Japan with all these wars. We are doing that, man. If you look in your chat, look at the chat. Yo, China, hop down. Oh. Okay, nice. Uh, yeah, China and um Ottomans are going. England, do you have an admiral? Hop down. Oh no, you calling Danube? I don't have any good admirals. Well, I think this is all I can take. Two regions. Send your army to the Ottoman border, he's gonna die. Send me the peace deals, bud. Wait, hang on. You can't take, like, West Prussia or something? Um. Oh, I can take Vest Poison. Is that allowed? Yes. Yeah. I mean, you don't need it to form the map, though. It's nice. It's territory. True. I mean, if it's not connected to your nation, uh, wait, wait. What are you taking? Because it might. I mean, as long as you have support, it's, it's connected by to... sea. We're good. Oh, Scandi's decking on me with Ottomans. Okay, okay, cool. Yeah. What? What are you talking about? Yeah. Wait. Oh, oh, you're sending it to Asia. Never mind. Good. I ain't yeah, doing yeah. that, man. I ain't you... doing that. I forgot about the Suez. My bad. You forgot. Okay, I think that's a peace deal. Yeah, that is. It's a uh, ninety-six. There you go. It's so over, bro. There, that's my legal, perfectly legal peace deal. Uh, I mean, I need to bring up my entire army for this one. It's, it's so <laughs> ugly. <laughs> Alright, Spud, uh, China and China is going to... It's perfect if China joins. I can use a big sphereling. I can take Sneedling. Big sphere, though. Take Sneeding. You should unspear me, China. Oh, God, I got attacked. But, uh, yeah, stay mobbed. We're, we're doing this. We're going to fight this. Minus four mobbed. digging, base? Yeah. No, where's my friend It's about time I fucked over the Ottomans for once instead of... Yeah, seriously. Fuck this guy. Joining Burgundy in three... Oh my fucking god. Ottoman fucking Why? empire? What? He's like dead. Wait, okay. against... Get? Against me? Okay, really? Here we go. Is the Ottomans gonna be in this already? Cause that's... I can't take Hungary right now, man. Turkey. Oh my god. Turkey. Fuck this stupid... You fucking... <laughs> fuck, fuck, fuck. <sighs> the Ottomans again, this f I hate them, like, every time. Are you actually still doing this, uh, Ottomans? Uh, yeah, I am. Wait, no, no, I'm staying out. I just want Sinai off of Italy. We can invade, like... Well, depending on how they've been researching, we could also do what I just did to the Albians on them. Oh, does he have gas? Wait, how much? It's quite doubtful as to him having gas here. Found the DM on the side of the road, heroin needle hanging out of his arm, ass spreads, prolapse on the sidewalk. <laughs> he said, I will sub you, you I will sub. <laughs> this guy's a good Samaritan, that's what he is. Move your stuff up in Croatia, I'm pretty- they can take okay, it all the time, so. Oh, it's fine. Don't fucking worry, Lizard. You're, you're... I'm not here. I'm a serial. Yeah, I'm a serial warrior. What can I do? I am getting circle. The hell? Zombie might bring two big ass countries and fighting a war at the same time. <laughs> also encircling. <laughs> I feel like this is kind of a make or break moment, though. Is he encircling Virtual Rock? He's got, he's yeah. Got Look at Pence. Oh my God! What's what's happening? Oh, it's so over. Virtual, like virtual like Rock. Half your army is not near the border. <laughs> virtual Rock getting encircled. That's kind of what I assume. I've seen this army. one. It's a classic. Is this another spot gun moment? I've seen this one. Like before. right click his army on the Poland, it will be over. <laughs> Why does he keep overextending, no, no, bro? Uh, spot, I have a full attack. We can hit him in the planes up here. I'm just gonna attack him across the fucking front. Um, oh, so I'm gonna uh, just fight. Uh, doing it. Oh, Ottomans! Ottomans got gas. Ottomans got yeah, gas. Who cares? If China doesn't have it, then he's fucking dead. I think Burgundy oh, should join. Mark Turok still isn't pulling troops. What are you from... doing? What are you doing? I might join. You could join our anti scandy alliance. Yeah, I, w I would actually give you your land back if you did that. Sounds like a deal. Oh. Wait, you, right. got, you got pretty, you got pretty uh, high neighbors. That sounds like a lie. That sounds like a lie. You shouldn't uh, listen okay. to them. You're just a pawn to them. I don't know why <laughs> you would think that. Uh, it sounds like a cope. I'm throwing this war. Russia 
and Poland have officially swapped their army positions. There you are. On the other <laughs> so true. That means, for the purposes, no one is encircled because the lines. Yeah, no one's yeah. encircled. I'm just trying to, to kill this one stack, but I know I'll collapse. ADF, we got something big going on. Just do it immediately. Oh, God. Any any gas, it's gonna be great. Do it immediately. Fucking <laughs> ADF, mate. Yeah, I am. Who's joining on Japan's side? Anyone? Probably no. Sandra. Wait, who's that kid? <laughs> Maybe New Sandra. New Sandra might join Japan. Okay, we're attacking. Oh, yeah, I'm gassing him. <laughs> gas, 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 gas. I gotta step on the gas. GC. Okay, great, great, great. We're in there. Yeah, yeah we're getting him. We're getting him. I hate that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Gonna yeah. step on the gas. I want to get one victory, okay? Come on, let me wipe this deck. That's all I Oh, we did, roll a, we did roll a 2 to a 9, though. That, that oh, is I so want to more. not be so unequivocally yeah, over. Uh, no. Okay, I surrender because I'm done. <laughs> the zombie rage quitting this country, he's subbing. <laughs> I'm gonna die because all these battles are. Could you, uh, could you just retreat good. then unpause? Jesus, man. It's over for Japan. <laughs> the Scandinavians and Grand Colombians won the race for Kyoto, though. Sad. Can someone give me money? Thanks. Give me money. Give me money. I'll give you money, man. I'll give you money. Why'd I mope for this? One <laughs> whole dollar? Yeah, it's not worth moping. I, I thought, I was like, maybe China joins or something, I don't know, but... Asia's kind of just pathetic and they don't help each other in anything. So-called free thinkers when their ally needs to be thrown under the bus. <laughs> <laughs> what part of Japan are we okay, all getting to? Done. So, like, the Edo and Tokai regions underneath me are like 47 each, but Hokkaido's like 19, so... Hey, on the next rehost, can you delete the ghost of Vienna? No. <laughs> Not the little yeah. ghost of Vienna. I haven't gotten like mainland Japan yet. Could I get Shikoku? Yeah, let's give uh, Baroni a Jikoku. Can I get Shikoku? We need a new India perm, not just a top. China has researched a mill tech. He probably has gas. It's fine. We can, we're can. we going to crush him okay, anyway. So Japan surrendered. Regional advantage. Yeah. Okay, Japan Did he surrender? Well, that was easy as fuck. Uh, cool. More territory. Yeah. I Holy thought we didn't God, take no. Shikoku, but then I realized that's just England. <laughs> yeah, it's just a really similar color. Yeah, China is the same color as GC. Japan is just dead. <laughs> Jesus. I found a permanent India player. Okay, and who is it? Literally Poland. Okay, that sounds oh, good. Menace. Um, <laughs> that guy was menace. You can hop in on the <laughs> next Zeho. Just, uh, just tell him to prepare for some serious industry micro with his India. Uh, it's by the tap and oh no mind he paused oh okay. the day before Spice Islands. you can't do this to me you know how much uh, i sacrificed adf shut up <laughs> okay so it's japan. I love the ADF. it is japan why japan pause the adf is promoting sustainable farming in asia the adf is doing good things yes by using what, japanese what? corpses as fertilizer what does yeah. mean by this? there's been a bit of uh, environmental damage due to the use of agent. Is it finally happening this time? I swear. Join, 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 join. All right. Out, China, join. All right, hit him in the planes immediately. I have a. Do I, I join this guy. war? If you want to, for sport. Just massively going to him. I mean, I'm only attacking in two provinces right now. No, no, get, go Nova side. Go Nova side. Uh, that's why I'm actually putting my five attack. We're going. We're going on two speed, no less. I don't know, go, go, go. Oh, one speed. Oh, you have gas! 
Oh, we're gassing people. Oh, the absolute state of China. Holy shit, look at the, look at the casualties. Uh, look at the casualties. The casualties. He got the tech. He might not have gotten the month tick. Go to Ponce, though. Go to Ponce. This is how you come back against the Asians. Oh, my God. So hey guys, this is how I conquered the Albians, by fighting the Chinese in Bulgaria. Just win the war, get the take from Spiracy, and boom, you win. Yeah, boom. China, can you if they If they make it to Bulgaria, I don't know about all that. Where are they? Neighbor, are you seriously going to come back next week and play this country, though? I am. <laughs> Listen, I'm open to the idea of a rump state around Bohemia and Moravia. I'm open to the idea. But you can't be the Albians. You know, for 25 infamy, you get uh, cores on all that? Yeah, I know. I'm, I know that, but I'm still saying there's options. I'm fighting, bro. Don't keep them on life support. So, do you not need Pomerania to form Germany? It's being transferred. Uh, yeah, I need to transfer. And it's going to be a great war once India joins. So. If India joins. If India, India, India should join. I, I consider no joining that war against China, but I've beat up oh too many God. Asian people today. Oh, they're reinforcing? Oh, my oh God. they're right. waiting. That's going to be a great yeah. war. Okay. Another shitty great war. Right, okay, so I, let's actually call everyone in then. DM is already in. The ADF so. should join the Europeans in this great war. Yeah, you in here. You're gonna be truce, Japan's joining. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. that sucks. Well, oh yeah. well. He and his eight game. brigades are going to contribute masterfully <laughs> to this war. Hey, people can still join instantly. Get the fuck in. Call people in. Oh, I yeah, will. call me in. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna join. Call in a member of the ADF to truce block people. Oh god, yeah. Call in fucking Spain or England or... Oh! oh it's all in. Yeah. Oh. Okay, okay, call me in. Hey, what side's Burgundy joining on? I just called Desert. you in. I just called you in. I just called you in. Desert, call me in. Join, Desert, <laughs> call me in. Join, join. It was their great decision to escalate this shit. Call me into the war. Yeah, call let's us in. Have... Yeah, let's go. Okay, send the lines. Send the lines. Now let's take oh, all of our troops that we in. put into Japan and invade China. Yes. Is Russia in? Alright, fuck it. We'll do... We're doing this. We're doing it live. We can start off in, like, the northern part of right, Vietnam that he holds. Hey, I think we need more people. This is everyone, isn't it? Uh, Ethiopia's in here. Ethiopia's in here. Also in my Africa armies. Bro, I actually forgot to research gas. I'm so sad about spare? that. I got gas. <laughs> Where are we landing in China? Uh, I don't think we could land in China, man. Burgundians are coming. <laughs> the Burgundians are coming. Does India not have India India's getting gas as well. The absolute state. Going to Vietnam, baby. The ADF should come with me into Vietnam. I am, I am, I am. I'm eating some, like, potato fries, man. You're eating fries with a potato? Are you serious? Actually, they're sweet potato fries. They're pretty These Asians potatoes. aren't worth not eating your fries, so you can for sour, that. like sour potatoes. Hey, follow up, follow up. I can't lie about this. I'm not seeing enough following up. I want more follow up. I'm so, so Get me follow ups of Spider Man. Sure. I'm me. I'm them all. Drop and follow up, soldier. This is like fighting the AI, but easier. <laughs> Follow up. Um, oh, um, I wiped um, a bunch of Chinese transports, by the way. <laughs> why the fuck are the Eldians joining? It couldn't get any worse for them. Uh, I'm, I'm, in, I'm invading bro. Greece. I'm starting why would I show that? I just die. <laughs> Fact check, true. Why'd you mope? Fact <laughs> check, objectively true. China doesn't have gas? Like, we're just attacking. Yeah, China does not have gas. They got gas. 
Even Terrania has gas. Fine, I'm standing in Gallipoli right now. I do have gas. Wait, Wait, why are we following up for? Well, yes. love the almighty. I'm gonna gas the Indians and Chinese. You know, mo almighty. moments like these, I'm reminded of the times where Narkick was pleading with Spud Gun to have mercy on him. <laughs> oh, Gallipoli, oh, they caught me. Holy oh, shit, look at the Gallipoli! The Gallipoli! Holy oh, shit, it's yep. so good. It's, it's like 12,000 to 1. It's 12,000 to 1. Oh, the Gallipoli. <laughs> it's 12,000 to 500. It's over for them. I don't even think you need my help, to be honest. Just look at this situation now and consider the fact I never wanted the Ottomans to be my enemy. And they chose to be my enemy by constantly joining wars against me. Everybody wants, wants to be me. your enemy. We ain't well, spared no sympathy, though. To be fair, Spud, it was just a bunch of subs, and I just kept on telling them <laughs> that Spanish I knew what I liked. Yeah, there was subs a lot of the time, but also you had Narsek himself, the Ottoman, the real Ottoman player. Oh, retreat to neutral India. I hate China! 18 minutes. For Istanbul. Can we get this 2k stack deleted, please, India? Dude, I'm paused. Okay. You might win the race to Istanbul, but I'm gonna win the race to Beijing. I'm gonna win. No, no, I'm gonna win the race to Ankara. There we go. Move across the strait. It's open. It's open. Oh, we can try to circle them from behind. Where are we going now? Are we going across the strait? Of course we are. Yes. Um, Why even question that? Actually, they have like no troops back here. Moving another 60k toward Vietnam. Bosa. Good morning, yeah. Vietnam! Where's Ataturk when you need him, man? <laughs> India doesn't have gas. India doesn't have gas. Rest the fucking piss, Tyrannians Ottomans. have started the push against the Indians. What? Uh, the Shittimans are getting demolished. Oh my god. Gas them. I do hit them. I just wish the original players were there to see their nations just fucking die. I know. <laughs> Sadly, they all. They all left. Let's start heading into mainland China up the coast. I don't even care anymore. Oh, I'm so I'm still gassing. <laughs> Dude, I never thought starting off on Bjornia that I would as England be in a great war doing a Vietnam invasion with Scandinavia while you guys fucking curb stomp the autumn. Gas to the Chinese man in Bulgaria. The wheel, oh, Dude, yes, I, I'm gonna win the race to Ankara. Yeah. I'm winning the race to Ankara. From this great dream. Ankara. I still don't understand how we won the war from last session. Give it to Larkin, gentlemen. Yeah. Okay, we're under attack in Nanning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, great, great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're attacking in Pingwao. The gas is kind of open. They're attacking in Pingwao. Guys, they were attacking in Pingwao. Wait, wait, wait. Are they attacking in Pingwao or are they attacking in Pingwao? They're attacking in Jinping. They're attacking in Orange Chicken. They're attacking in Xi Zhanhanji. Reinforce Hua Wei. Reinforce Hua Wei. There's a province named Pingle. Can somebody go in and rename it to Pringle? Pringle. India got gas. India got gas. Aww. Like, everyone in the game has Dude, gotten it except for them. Shout out to Kirk, he's liberating Jay, he's liberating Jay. Hare Krishna, my son! <laughs> Interesting, he rushed to Israel before occupying the territory he wants. <laughs> Why is that? If, if someone played Israel, I would give them the nose. Are there any, like, LARP decisions to burn a palace in this? I wish there were, that'd be base.
The SS Novella Bruges explodes? That's it, Burgundy. We're going to war over this. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Uh, this is on China! This is on China! <laughs> you can't do this! We can send. If this isn't a sign from God, I don't know what is. is it? <laughs> oh, he's pouring send. more men into Andrew. <laughs> They literally blew up my ship! Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, we're gassing them. We still have the gas over them. Do we, do we still have gas? No, 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 no. On China, we do. They're moving in from India. When are we gonna win, Ankara? Alright, alright, alright. All right. Uh, maybe Billy after this Sim. battle, we pull back and hold Vietnam. I just posted the LARP event I got. <laughs> <laughs> That can pull in the no, no, right? Oh my god. Nice move, Albians. Send the call okay. to arms. Send the call hey, to arms. Hey, bro, he needs to reconnect his territory. He needs to PLC ally me, no. Oh, oh bro, don't actually, let me have actually. a victory, bro. I've been losing every single <laughs> I'm match. Joking, man. I can't He's join joking. anyway. I, I can't join. Just let me have one win, man. Oh my god, bro. The Ottomans joined. literally joined. can't join. The Ottomans are in the war. Just unpause. The final. I can't LB join. The Wait, why did Holland? Oh, oh, okay, oh, oh my god! Why the fuck are they joining? All joining the PLC? What? Dude, why are people? Joined. The why are people joined. joining the PLC? One kill, one kill! Bro, I was their ally, man. <laughs> Almost like Pokey is unreliable. Fed up with this world. Not even. It's I'm fed up with this world. It's tearing me apart, Lisa. <laughs> why everyone betray me? I'm fed up with this world. <laughs> That's actually so sad. Well, that's my involvement in this war, you know. I'm heading back home. I actually don't get why they joined this, man. <laughs> they didn't really. I'm taking Slavonia. Uh... Aren't you gonna do the God. take Albions from Sphere, CB? Yes. Can you not, please? No, I will. It won't Come annex on. you, it'll just make him form Germany. 13 war score. He gets Scandy, the accept this and call me into the war, thanks. I'm not going to be able to annex you, it's impossible. You know, you're not part of my cultural union, you're Bohemia. Let's invade you're China. We're, we're taking China right now. Some Wait, then China. why would you want to scare me? Don't you want I'm to I'm making Beijing Germany? Ben look like a fucking joke. <laughs> why does every Chinese name sound like a parody of a Chinese name? <laughs> yeah, Weevil, well, you gotta land in here with us, bro. We're fucking destroying them. Oh, are you oh, going you for Beijing? <laughs> Told you I am. Let's get the Wang Dynasty on the throne. India's not even trying to help, okay, even though he has gas, gas now. Alright, guys, <laughs> Beijing is ours. Beijing is ours. Hey, 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 he literally blew up my battleship according to the game. He might have gas defense by now, but I think the damage is already done. We killed so many with it. Beijing. Wait, wait, wait. I need to have the sneak. I need to have the Decopen guy take fucking Beijing. <laughs> we gotta get some shit from China off of this. Okay, we've been attacked in Guyang. You're just making this shit up. These aren't real names. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. These aren't real names. <laughs> okay, they're sending stuff into Gu Lin right now. You're making okay. this shit up. <laughs> he really isn't. Province name? I made it up. Oh, I'm, I'm attacking Gulen, that's okay. Luigi Cadorna just arrived. <laughs> Luigi Cadorna! Space. <laughs> oh, Italy's here! Yes! Yes, yes! <laughs> it's Luigi Cadorna! They don't have- <laughs> They have no gas now, they have gas. No, 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 oh, no, yeah, no. Yeah. Still them. I'm still shedding. I'm moving more shit up from the here. Killing everything as it moves. 3k to 7k. I love fighting China. Tanks are really good in this, so... He's still taking Ooh, even tanks. with us, even though we yeah. have zero. We rolled a zero. 
Because we know tanks. Guys, I ask you to check out Beijing. Vincent de Copen is taking the city. <laughs> Vincent de Copen. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's, that's way too funny. Another general called Blaise Dupont. Fucking Guys, he's, he's avenged the USS Novell Bruges. <laughs> Beijing then got siege down. You know what? Me taking Slavonia here, there's a lot of Germans in it. Check Guys, the, the, the Copen has set his sights on something new. Nanjing. Oh no. <laughs> well, I came into this game last session and saw the fucking entire Asia against me. I was fucking sweat. This, that was not very uh, justified. Not very like, wholesome. This has target. to be the biggest Russian comeback, honestly. Session and ah, oh, come on. Kill the PLC though. The Diplo will change next week. I want to keep killing. Neighbor will become a rump Bohemia Moravia. He's not going to be allowed to be the Albians anymore. Fucking, okay, I support it. Bohemia, <laughs> Moravia, and end. Poland though. Session end. All right, good session, I guess. <laughs> this was an amazing right. session. <laughs> so true. Like Okay, so how would you rate my rule lawyering? It was fine. It was, good, it was good. Honestly. No dumb. This has been the best zombie game of Dempsey game. Yeah, they were all fair. Dempsey's gonna have to deal with a miss, though. I think the Asians are really annoyed. Yeah, sure. they all yeah no they shit. Playing. They've been hug boxing the whole game, and the moment we start attacking them, but, they start like, all fucking shit, dying. But that can be on him to try to call them down, so not rage quit or whatever. Now they're gonna rage quit because they lost. <laughs> I was like not gonna join that dog pile because I didn't really see a funny reason to, but that LARP event, it was a call from God. Yeah. They yeah. sunk the Louis team. Hey, they sunk the SS Novell Bruges. <laughs> That's your capital city. Almost this entire alliance, like, didn't show up. Like, like, Ottomans didn't show up, India didn't show up. Who could have thought that they would actually... I didn't think they'd show up. Look at that, Rabbit Bota shows up on that Japan. That's some dedication. Yeah. He's yeah, the so one guy in their alliance who showed up. Alliance is still alive. <laughs> if he didn't, if he didn't play Japan, if he didn't play Japan, the AI might do culture tests. Rabbit Bota is, like, the most dedicated to their alliance, and he's the one who got consistently fucked in the ass by them. <laughs> trade in every fucking possible turn. Okay, I like it. I like it. Green Forest telling us he will smite us with the power of a thousand suns only to not show up. <laughs> yeah, I don't... <laughs> oh, no. Green Forest is coming in here, man. He is here. Yeah, in India. Go on India. Oh, right, Green Forest is here? Okay, I'll go it's India. It's the shithole, but I think you can turn it around. It's not, like, horrible. I mean, at it's least on India, problem. you're not losing much from the war. Okay, Crafter's gonna be Russia. Who was playing this original? Did he, like, rage quit, or is he just no, not? No, it, it was Kuyun, and then literally Poland took over, said he wanted to be the new India. Okay. But now he's not here, so... I mean, Kuyun also right. rage quit because he got bored, right? I think I mean, getting it. bored was his excuse. He got bored of being in the hug box, so we came and destroyed the hug box. Does that mean I can do my own Diplo? He got bored of losing yeah. thousands of dollars oh, per yeah. day. India has cores on Sakim. Do with that information what you will. Can yeah, I yeah. conquer? Can, can I take Sakim? Like I wonder though, like, what's gonna happen after this war? Is it gonna be the East versus West bullying each other? Nah, dude, if that ha <laughs> like, that's not happening. Nah, yeah. it's not. In a the real war, it is going to dissolve. It. People still have, to it. It does not yeah. happen. People still have venom Maybe in the pistol you put break up the hawk box. Maybe I can get my course back. Oh, Hook down the hawk box. Dempsey's <laughs> playing Ethiopia apparently. I think he's he's getting some gringo to play Ottomans. Imagine the game starting on time. What a novel. Oh, yeah, yeah, imagine a game actually being... It's a very novel idea. Okay, okay I'm gonna go get some food, okay? I'll be back, because it's taking fucking food. Zombie has to pick some leaves from a tree. It has to be a eucalyptus one. <laughs> they eat nothing else. Go. Lizard is already undergoing a wholesale mental breakdown. We're eight minutes late. Okay. It should have started, like, ten minutes ago. 
I'm going to be lying on my deathbed thinking, oh, I wish I had those eight minutes I lost at the beginning of session eight of the Dempsey game. I'm stuck in lobby, oh, by the way. I don't know. I'm stuck in lobby. You to surrender you this now. But that adds up. Uh, I'm conditionally uh, surrendering, not unconditional. I wish I spent more time shitposting on Discord. <laughs> 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 no, I mean, that's not a bad regret. I wish I Order spent shots. more time arguing about niche political topics with Nurse Reno. I told Japan this entire time that this hug box went too far. No, no, I've been no, no. begging. I've I've been begging him to like let me <laughs> talk about it. Guys, guys, we were just following orders. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, green for it. We actually were. Yeah, attack India, man. Who killed my army? I can't attack most, India now. Please. Fucked over. Japan. And Russia, most, Russia doesn't want to ally me, so we are stuck now. Japan oh, still wants the hug box. He's dedicated. Man, he I really wonder why Russia doesn't want to ally you. I'm so confused. <laughs> why wouldn't you guys get arrested? Russia ally you. Man, I wanted to kill, kill him. him. Like, Terania has me. fucking swapped sides four times now. Surely me and Russia should just I mean, well, like, finish him point. off at this point. Wait, 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 wait. Am I player? Am I hearing a base diplomatic take from Green Force? I never. This is can't unprecedented. Be. It can't be. Autismo is just like wait, 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 wait. It's it's I mean, punished green for him. It's literally like. Seriously, a, why? A why? Like, I've been talking to the Russian game. sub and the Russian player on Discord, but they're both like, nah, bro. Terrania gets to keep his course, man. Like terrania has been quite a meme in this whole game. Back is originally Russia. Uh, I don't even know what. No, man. That's like Virg virtual, virtual cock. No, who was the original original Russia? Oh yeah, best yeah, watch yeah. out. Yeah, yeah. Best yeah. watch out. Lost one war and quit the Dempsey, game. Dempsey, yeah, Dempsey, we can start. We can start. We can start. We can start. Wait, wait, wait. We are. Hey, best hey, yeah, hey Dempsey, we can start Russia the game now. Stopping. <sighs> so, what is the unironic status of this war? Green Force is going to surrender. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, no, I'm conditionally surrendering. Apparently, it's no. conditional. Yeah. <laughs> okay, let's move down to different channels. I've added everything I want. I think. Where's the peace chat? There is no. Can I can I peace out of this war? Can I separate surrender? Uh, please get out of um, right now. Khorasan. We want Terrania their cores back. Um, India's Giga colony. Everything else is on Ottomans. Yeah, and uh, except for Yemen, I, I'm gonna add another. What, what about that cake from Yemen. Sphere business? Oh yeah, that's, uh, yeah. that's absolutely being added. China, it's no big deal anyway. Yeah, yeah. I'm I'm gonna say this right now. Like, I don't care who takes the colony, but whoever does better have all the fucking iron techs, because that's it's like the world be supply me. of It's going to be me. Okay, there's good. no okay. negotiation about that. You're taking Beijing? Never say there's no negotiation. I'm going to dispute that. I'm taking the cotton out. We're not taking Beijing. Oh, there's what other iron? Also, oh, stop attacking what? me. India, I, I, I wrote India the thing. I wrote the thing. Oh, wow. Well, we're not taking Beijing. Holy shit, that important negotiation is out of the way, guys. I think Arcadia should get Beijing. Because that was ever gonna happen. You said Giga Iron Center. Colony. I didn't know of any other one. Autismo. Where's Autismo? It's not a colony. It's Beijing. But Autismo, gun. you in here? Yes. Ben, Captain Ben called it the capital of the civilized world. But gun. Yes. What? Can we negotiate, bro? Probably not. My yeah, brother in Christ, look at your nation. <laughs> Alright, my LARP event is complete. Nanjing is sieged. <laughs> nice. What's the worst score? Mm -hmm. None of your business. This Hold is that. like the most retarded war I could have ever fought. Why did, why did Russia- Crafter, didn't you say that like last well, week? It was his plan to do this, okay? Go Oops. across another country and fight China. Don't take Macau! Crafter, you haven't played a session of this fucking campaign then. I don't think anyone has fought a war where they haven't gone across a country they border. Don't siege Macau, please. Guys, please! Don't, don't siege Macau, please! 
I'm sieging Macau. That's literally against the rules, though. You're not allowed to like murder enemy troops after wait, 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 the enemy has surrendered. I thought that was figuratively against the rules. Have no, you unconditionally out of the way. No, guys, you're not allowed to murder enemy troops on your face. Wait, man, let's, let's get this done. No, guys, that breaks the Geneva <laughs> Convention. <laughs> <laughs> We've been breaking the Geneva Convention. Right we I, I need to. I need to take off. Take off down. Yemen. God, we're not taking off Yemen. We're taking what? Yemen. I want Manchuria. No, why? That's literally irrelevant. What? What do you want about? So. Ethiopia is my ally, man. Green. Bro, that's what are we are irrelevant? Attacking your army somewhere? We're not purposely attacking our army. Seizing them down. But the spear war goal is gone. Wait, how? Is he out? He removed he them. He's out of sphere. That's actually against the rules. What? what? No, that's actually you can't just, uh, uh... You can't just invalidate the war. The rules, it's like releasing bro. a country that's about to be taken in the war. Yeah, okay. like a higher speed. Oh, I yeah, removed myself. He didn't let's remove go higher speed. Me. Oh, I think it was probably India that removed him. I, I didn't remove anyone. I, was I removed myself. I removed myself. <laughs> My brother in Christ, you just have India re-add him and then add the CB on India. Declare war on him, China. That's your sphere. On who? No, Wait, what, who are I you talking about? What, what, what sphere I are you talking about? I removed myself, bro. <coughs> Zombie, add Elbians. Elbians. Neighbor, don't break out until this war's over. I Neighbor already did it him. a long time ago. He did it, so uh, punish him. Who? Wasn't it Elbians who broke out a sphere? Yeah, Elbians broke out a sphere. It wasn't shot. Oh, who? Wait, wait, so they can't do that? Or no? They They're not allowed to do that. Okay. Elbians are in a sphere. India just re added them to his. Okay, I'm going to add remove from sphere on India instead of China then. Okay, done. Okay, cool. It works out. I'm not allowed to break out a sphere, bro. No, you're not. No. It's invalidating a war goal. I mean, I mean, you can break out a sphere on the Danubians, but like, you can't break out of sphere when somebody's about to do a take from sphere, CB. Yeah, when, once the war's over. Actually, bro. Once actually. the war's over, it's ogre. Actually, I really appreciate Zombie re-adding him to his sphere so I could then add the proper war goal on him instead. I appreciate that, Zombie. Get this done quickly. I'm gonna declare... We're on zombie for take from sphere. It's over, Spud Gun. My war goal in the Ottomans definitely getting added on this shit, yeah. Yes. How much war score is left for me to add? Let me check. Oh, uh, we have 81. Uh, let me check. So I can doubles. add 81. I can add 81. No, no. you can add 19. <laughs> Oh, 19. You could take oh, off Yemen. Yeah, yeah, we're coming to the end of the peace negotiations and we have 81 free war score, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so true. Okay, then can we send the peace? Peace in our time. Peace in our time. Good war, everyone, good war. Peace on the map. I'm so glad I got to gas all those charts. To be perfectly honest, that was one of the worst wars I've ever partaken in. That was pretty painful. Can you send the peace right away? And a great war as well, apparently. Greatest war in the Dempsey game. A great Asian bloodbath. Are we bath. taking all the war goals? Oh, yeah, that is yeah. yes. That is under 198. Okay, there it is. Yeah. 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 Okay. Ah. Okay. Congratulations, everyone. Good, good war. Oh, it's beautiful. I just crashed. I have a, I have a better map now. It's beautiful. Shit, look at Poland. I didn't notice how bad Eat. Poland was. Can we get a sub for Poland? 
Yeah, yeah, is there even a Polish system. player anymore? He quit. No, he's he not. Quit. No, uh, yeah, okay. he's dead. He's dead. No, I'm the Polish sub. Actually. Poor guy. You spent like two hours trying to convince well, me to swap sides. I, I always knew Crafter was a sub. This is the saddest fucking Albion son, Burgundy. That Poland, I like how it is. It's just a fucking buffer. Exactly. Keeping Crafter away from us. Wait, so it's <laughs> fun. One, even swap even sides. I'm only in from Germany now, right? Yeah. All right. So who wanted to fund uh, India? Um, I will only fund you if you declare war on China. You declare on China. Yes. No. China declaration first. Money after. I'm just gonna have justification. I'll give you ten million dollars. Same. I'm making forty-four thousand a day. Upping mean. Upping mean. Upping mean. Green force is going fucking mad. Great, great wars while we're both cut down. Yo, Danny, what more do you need to form Germany? Uh, just a couple of things. Blizzard, type in the chat. There you go. Thank you. Oh, the misery. Oh, the library. Roman Empire. Good job. It's gone on the Reddit. Hey, scan the break alliance, please. I form my maps by changing the localization files. Oh my fucking... Where the hell is this fucking province? There you go. Okay, do you need to add? And where's the next fucking... Yeah, I have to find it. Um... Uh... I'm joining against this, but it's over. Holstein... Hainan, Zambia, Mali... Zambia. Oh my god, where the actual fuck... Where the actual fuck is the province? I can't fucking find it, man. Uh... <laughs> How the hell do you have a ship? Oh, I see. Sneed about it. Ah, there it is. Offer me that. It's going to be beautiful. He's going to form Gomini. Oh, nice. <gasps> Bink! Oh my god. Oh, oh my god. Uh, Wait, I forgot. Hey. I've got the uh, the event. Do the do the do, it, the, do, it, do it. the max one. I'll go to sanctions if I do it, alright? Do, 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 do it, do it, do it, do it. I would still do it. Fucking do it, fucking do it. Sanctions are worth, honestly. It's like actually worth it. <laughs> is it yeah, worth man. going to sanctions? Nah, it's not. Yes, 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 yes. It's so much No, actually shut up about telling me to go to sanctions. Just make Bohemia a rump state. Oh, you did the Silesian one, Lance. What do you get if you accept it? All the cores. All the cores. Cores on... Oh. Uh, yeah. That would have been epic. You could have just restored order, but no. He's how, how he literally yeah. couldn't have, he but okay. Restored. He's got Polish land. Yeah. Spud gun. Buddy, you still there? <laughs> I just don't know. It seems like you're trying to speak. But you just took a hell of a hit. Listen, I didn't take cores in your whole country, so... Yeah, but... We have a route where you can be a rump state. How do you keep getting away with this shit, bud? Fucking... Fuck. He can't keep getting away with it! Actually, what I'm thinking right now, like... Get away with it, he literally fought for it the whole fucking campaign. What do you want about? We overcome several big, large hug boxes to do this, you know? Yeah. That is exactly why I'm like, bro, how the fuck did he come back from that? Because he, had his he does he's not retarded oh. Diplo where he doesn't hugbox all of his neighbors and they get backstabbed anyway. <laughs> you be, like, so, I hugbox yeah. Japan because he kept giving me land. The original deal No, with I, Japan. I will give you, I, I think the Japan hugbox shit was actually based because you totally conned him and scammed him even oh. if you didn't realize it. Who no, I did realize it. Tank factories are called barrels, the hell? Bill Factory. What, what is this, Henry Turtledove? Yeah, this is literally... What? <laughs> what was that reference? 
So in Henry Turtle Doves, um, like in one of his novels, instead of making the invention called tanks, he calls them barrels because they were made in the U.S., not the U.K. Right. Well, like the reason why the tank got its name was they named it like uh, a tank of water to like not make the name obvious of what it was to like, keep it secret during the uh, war. And when you you say barrels, you mean. Barrels, 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 man. The American name for tank is barrel. Fascinating. Or at least in the South. The American name for tank is barrel. No, 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 no. I'm not the soy jack. You're the soy jack. I'm kind of retarded, but is there any way to like remove craftsmen? What, what do you What do you mean by that? <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> like, can I can I unpromote? I Are you going to Khmer Rouge and try to genuinely like, de cannot afford this industry, your country? You know? Like, just kill all your intellectuals and, like, factory workers? All part experience. Uh, I'm going to the greats need for... no. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. The greats uh, need? Okay, send me the piece. I certainly will. Never? No, there you go. Germans on their way to name a province as Schaftenberg. <laughs> <laughs> no, little German boy, do not go in there. There is poop and shit in Farten. <laughs> well, there it is. We did it. Germany is formed. After 22 episodes, many brutal wars, some harder than others. Lots of diplomacy and, of course, a lot of help from some fantastic, loyal allies who fought alongside Bavarian and Danubian troops and pulled me out of a lot of potential blunders along the way. The borders are still a mess and practically this Germany isn't really any different from the large Danubian confederation I had built up anyway. The literacy, the accepted pops, the army, it's all the same because of the gradual approach that we've been taking for 22 episodes. So it took a long time, and this Germany was formed on the 17th of January, 1903. As you can sort of see, although the colours are a bit weird on the diplomat mode there, which is why I created this instead, I don't own all the German corps yet. The Albion Confederation still holds on to a lot of German land. So as this series continues, we'll see how I approach completing this map. Pomerania and Holstein are to remain Scandinavian under the agreement, but the Albion corps must be taken either through yet more conquest, or reaching an accommodation. The so-called rump state, the wholesome little Bohemia. An agreement where he would essentially become a puppet, in exchange for me allowing his country to live on. That would most likely involve a transfer of the remaining German corps he owns. My preference would be that he reverts to Bohemia instead of continuing as the Albions, because as the Albions he would still have a lot of cores over my land, and the potential for a backstab would never be entirely gone. That event that pops up when you form Germany gives you the option for a varying degree of further cores that you can get. And this clearly wasn't balanced or intended for multiplayer, but so few people ever form Germany in MP that this hasn't been looked at. I mean, if you can take the bottom one without going to sanctions, it's blatantly overpowered. I chose the middle option for 12 infamy, which gives me cores over all of Silesia, just because it was the maximum I could take without going over 32.5 infamy. Which, by the way, was one of the very few things I could have done after forming Germany to undo everything and set it off into some kind of massive disaster. All for some regions with barely any accepted pops. Which is also the case for Silesia, the region I did get the core on. Taking Silesia at some point isn't that important for me. Mechanically speaking, allowing Bohemia, Moravia and Silesia to be owned by a rump state Bohemia, who's effectively my puppet, is a far better use of that land. He can use the accepted pops, he has an entire pool of generals that can fight alongside mine. The abundant industry and RGOs in those regions could be safely in my spear. What do you think? Should the Albions be allowed to continue as a wholesome little puppet rump state? We'll find out what happens in the next episode of this series. Do you see Finale in the title of this one? I don't. As well as the fate of Bohemia going forward in this series, we'll see if we can get this campaign out of its East versus West situation, which has become a farce by forcing China and India to fight each other for once. So that the true rivalry going on in this campaign between the Mediterranean Alliance and Scandian friends can come to the forefront. There's potential for a dual monarchy restoration here.
We'll see where the naval arms race is going and what Burgundy decides to do, because he's sort of caught between these two blocks. In the previous episode he got attacked by one of them and then backstabbed by the other. And finally, what is to be the future of Terrania? They're doing pretty well now under the player that went on to it a few episodes ago. He just gained land from China out of the Second Great War. But Russia is completely safe, the PLC is knocked out, and the player that has just gone on to it has no idea why Terrania owns Russian cores. Now to bring this episode past the hour mark I'm going to show you the war analyzers and have a closer look at certain countries' choice of researches, particularly when it comes to military directionism. Because that's pretty much the only factor that mattered in any of the wars in this episode to be honest. Even the ADF's latest attack on Japan. In fact I don't think I've ever seen another campaign in which gas was the deciding factor of so many wars, and then in such a big devastating fashion for each of these wars as well. Here's the analyzer for the 1v1 against the Albion Confederation. One thing I want to draw your attention to with this war was his symbolic decision to garrison the German border instead of the more defensible terrain around Bohemia for him. It's a symbolic choice but it's also kind of necessary, because theoretically if he's just garrisoning Bohemia and I occupy all my German corps I can tick her out for those, or use the stalemate rules without fighting a single battle or he'd have to attack me. But yeah that's probably the least defensible border I've ever seen. Now as for his research, in a save taken on the 31st of January 1900, the Elbians was well on the way to researching Integral Rail System, which is unlocked in 1898. The Elbians forgot about the military directionism tech and he forgot to save research points for it. And, and I think it's important to stress this, wasn't advised to by anyone. Allies aren't just there to help you in wars, people should keep each other right on important matters like this as well. When we passed into 1899 in the last part, I didn't just start saving points myself, I also told everyone I was in a VC with to do so. Then after he finished that railway tech, the first 1900 military tech he researched was army NCO training with morale and tactics. Then he researched military directionism but the war was long over by then. Both of us had the military industrial complex tech school which gives you plus 15% to military tech. Now Bavaria doesn't start with this so earlier in this game I actually changed that. I restored the academia, then chose the tech school. I can't remember exactly when it was, but in a previous video in this series you'll see me doing that. Both our countries have an equal tech school, but the Elbians actually has more literacy and research points than me. I hate to say it, but I'm being dragged down by Slovenes, Hungarians and whatnot. When I released the Kingdom of Hungary in a test save, it has a literacy of 76%, and my own Danubian literacy goes up to 97%. But the point is, if the Elbians was also optimal in saving research points and doing the tech, he would have gotten it first although I don't know how much by. Definitely not enough to matter unless we're actively fighting a war as these researchers come in. In our case any small gaps between either of us getting gas is kind of nullified by the fact our truce ended only halfway through 1900, but in the situation of a campaign where there's an ongoing great war as you get to 1900, the smallest difference in research points or a tech school could completely change everything. Now as for the next war, well the Ottomans had gas defence, he was fine, although he just got completely run over by our armies anyway because he was outnumbered, poorly positioned. And of course he had the Chinese and Indians guarding his flanks. Now let's see what those two big countries were researching in 1900. Well China was researching bolt action rifles and as you can see by his progress he started either in the start of January or right before it. Overall he's quite well caught up on Miltech, he had access to the gas tech, and if he did research that one he would have had it done in time for the war that he willingly joined. Missing out on the gas tech wouldn't have been that bad for China, he was under no direct threat of invasion from anyone. He decided to go and seek out a war to help the Ottoman Empire, where he got all of his forces in the area wiped because of gas attack after watching that happen to the Elbian Confederation. He made all those choices and then he was cheeky in the in-game chat, typical. Of course it was the Indian intervention into the war that massively escalated it and caused loads of people to join our side, loads of countries who were just absolutely sick of this Asian hugbox. 
You know, even the China and India players here who were substitutes or new to the campaign, without all the previous knowledge and context of this Asian hug box, could have still noticed that the two most populous, strongest countries in the world, allying together and joining irrelevant wars that weren't in their interest, might have led to some kind of reaction from the other players. Now, India is doing the same thing as China. He had access to military directionism, but he didn't research it. This save, this rehost, was actually the one where the original India player left the game. So, that's who was responsible for it. In the same way as China, India missing the gas tech for a while isn't that big a deal, unless he joins a war or gets decked on. You know, it would have been interesting if either India or China got gas first and then attacked the other and used it on them. Imagine that. Well anyway, India and China will hopefully fight later in this campaign, although it definitely won't involve gas attack. It'll just be a straight up bloodbath. Actually, one war that happened in this episode where gas wasn't a factor because both countries researched it in time, was Russia versus the PLC. Zombie saved research points and got gas on this country he was just substituting. He fought well and pulled off some good moves, but he just couldn't overcome the massive brigade difference between these two countries. And by the way, the Poland player didn't just quit like the India player, he genuinely had to go towards the end of that session. Unfortunately, the hour or so he missed was the hour in which his country just died to Russia and the Albians. Some people have asked for this, so I will leave you with the great powers and secondary powers. The end screen is a good way to show that, but nothing's ending. The campaign in the series is continuing. It's ridiculous that China is still by far and away the number one great power, when in this episode he had the Vietnam War going on in his south, five days in Peking occurring on his coastline, and this guy bloody leading a Russian-Mongol invasion from the north. Sorry for sharing Virtual Rock's IRL pick. Realistically, China should have absolutely collapsed and split up into loads of warring states at that point, but it doesn't work like that in this game. Thanks so much for watching though, I hope you enjoyed, and remember to like the video if you haven't, and subscribe. Consider joining the channel membership, when we have enough for the next emote, I'll make a member only community post to decide which one that will be. And of course remember to check out my stream, support me on Patreon, join my Discord, follow me on Twitter. Thank you so much everyone for watching, I'll see you in the next episode, bye! GG, that was fun. See you guys next week. I'm um, assuming I don't blow my brains out, which I might.